We never leave anyone behind. We do when it saves our asses. He's right. It was us or Mark. We had no choice. You always have a choice. Are you paying attention, Lightbright? We got evil speedsters, chill lane backstabbed us, the city's on fire with crazy red lightning, and your boy here barely has any speed. This ain't it. Oh, damn. The Red Death's coming after us next, isn't she? We destroyed the cosmic treadmill, her only ticket out of town. Yeah, we're screwed. The whole city is. Then we need to save it. People are in danger. They need my help. You can't even help yourself. This whole situation's a dumpster fire. Hey, look, Barry, if you lost most of your speed running on the Red Death's treadmill, I mean, how are we supposed to do anything? I don't know. That's why we need to get back out there and find a way. Rush into battle with no plan, yeah. That's not gonna get the rest of us killed. We need to stay put. Well, maybe we don't need to go back into the field to make our next move. I always liked you. Look, I got to know Ryan during our little chit-chat back at the loft. And if she blames us for keeping her here, then she's probably filled with hatred and rage by now. But your feelings we could trace with a little help from a friend. Mm -hmm. Babe, are you sure you want to do this? Babe, look, everyone on this team has a purpose. This is mine. Okay, so how's this supposed to work? Well, by boosting Cecile's empathic telemetry and superimposing it over the city grid, I can pretty much hone in on whatever she senses. Remember, you're looking for hate. Lots of it. Okay. Triangulation grid is... Ready? trying to push me out, but I found her. There's so much anger. It's overwhelming. Oh, the Red Death says CCPD. There are more people there. They're scared. That's Kramer and the other cops. Wait! There's somebody else. Close by. Oh. Oh. They're in pain. They're in so much pain. They're terrified. And you see who it is? Wait, 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 I, I got a location. Oh, frack me. Whoever she's locked into is inside the Red Death's home base. He's still alive! He's still alive! Who? Clark. 